The secondary biological treatment process is often the largest consumer of energy at a wastewater treatment plant. Proper maintenance of the diffused aeration grids, however, can keep operating costs down, optimizing the performance of your system so it runs more effectively and efficiently. In addition to saving energy, regularly scheduled diffuser cleanings and equipment inspections can also extend the service life of system components, saving replacement costs as well. There are several signs your aeration system needs attention. It's difficult to maintain desired dissolved oxygen levels. If you see increased back pressure at the blowers, or your system requires increased air to maintain performance, if you notice an increase in the blower energy consumption from year to year, if you see a surface bubble pattern that has uneven distribution, roll or boiling, or if you see a high volume of dirty water when purging moisture from the system, in order to maintain peak performance, if you continually see large boiling areas or dirty water during moisture purging, Sanitaire recommends that you drain the tank for a complete inspection of the system components. When inspecting an aeration tank, there are three things to look for. First, examine the piping for signs of twisting, cracking, and splitting. Damaged piping that is not replaced will degrade system performance, resulting in less effective treatment and increased energy usage. Then check the supports. Look for any bent or unattached supports that need replacing. Also make sure all nuts and bolts are tight. Finally, carefully examine diffusers and retainer rings. Make sure they are seated properly and tight. Look for damage to the diffusers, such as tears, rips, cracks, and more. Make sure rubber diffusers lie flat and have not stretched out of shape. If a diffuser has stretched out of shape or there is any damage, it should be replaced immediately. There are a few preventative steps you can take to sustain the performance of your diffused aeration grid. Perform regular cleaning of your diffusers every one to two years or as needed based on diffuser performance. Fouling can have a significant negative effect on your diffuser performance over time. Fortunately, liquid acid cleaning can restore membranes to near new condition and save up to 20% in power for older systems. And it's less expensive and less time consuming than manual cleaning. Sanitaire's portable liquid acid cleaning system can be used in situ, eliminating the need to take a tank out of service. Perform regular air bumping. Air bumping is the act of increasing the airflow two to three times the normal rate for short periods of time at predefined intervals. A simple way to maintain high performance, air bumping can effectively remove biological fouling on membranes and recover oxygen transfer efficiency. Check and purge moisture as needed. Hot air in the piping readily condenses and collects in the lowest point of the system. The buildup of condensate in the piping can reduce the effect of pipe diameter and increase head loss which can affect performance. Utilize a portable dissolved oxygen sensor. Faulty or non-calibrated instrumentation is the cause of over-aeration at many wastewater treatment plants. Portable dissolved oxygen sensors can verify DO values measured by online sensors in seconds. Install a pressure monitoring system. A pressure monitoring system specifically monitors your dynamic wet pressure or pressure loss through the membrane. Monitoring DWP is especially useful for high mixed liquor concentrations or in areas with high water hardness, as those applications are prone to DWP pressure increases over time. When it comes to efficient operation, selecting the right system is just the start. Properly maintaining your equipment is the key to keeping that system running as effectively and efficiently as possible.